In September, we talked about this model called Tiny Llama, which is an adaptation of the larger llama tool models. Tiny Llama is a project that represents an ambitious effort to basically have a pre-trained on a large language model with 1.1 billion parameters while using 3 trillion tokens. And just today, we see the official release of Tiny Llama. And it's something that you can actually access right now. And it's something that we're going to take a look at throughout today's video. It's a 1.1 billion llama model that is trained on 3 trillion tokens. This is a project that is built upon the architecture as well as the tokenizer of llama 2, which is ensuring compatibility with various open source projects already established on the llama framework. Now, Tiny Llama is something that has a compact size with only 1.1 billion parameters, which is something that makes it super versatile for applications that require limitation on computation as well as with memory usage. It's something that broadens the use case on various different fronts. And this basically means that anyone can actually run this model almost on every computer, laptop, or phone. Now, throughout today's video, we're gonna be showcasing this model a little bit more depth i have a video on this previously which i'll leave a link to in the description below which talks a little bit more about tiny llama but throughout today's video i'm going to be showcasing how you can install it just going a little bit more in depth on this and just showcasing the true capabilities of this new tiny llama that is officially released today so with that thought guys stay tuned and let's get straight to it if you would like to access our private discord where you can access subscriptions to ai tools for free you have consulting you have investment opportunities collaboration and so much more definitely take a look at this link in the description below if you would like to book a one-on-one -on -one with me where you can access my consulting services where i can help you grow your business or basically give you a lot of different types of solutions with ai definitely take a look at the calendar link in the description below Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the World of AI. In today's video, we're going to take a look at Tiny Llama once again, as this is a project that has been officially released today. And it has 1.1 billion in terms of its parameter size, and it has an extensive data set of 3 trillion tokens, which is quite unique to see for a small parameter size model. Now, their strategy is something that involves optimizing the process to achieve this within a relative short time frame of just 90 days. And they were able to do this by having the computational power of 16 powerful GPUs. We can see over here you have the A140G GPUs. And they were able to start this on September 1st of 2023. And this is why I made a video on this before as it was something that talked a little bit more about what they were trying to do. And I'll leave this link in the description below because it talks a little bit more on the training loss as well as how they were able to do this. They have a full breakdown on this as well, which is showcasing the Tiny Llama pre-training report. And we were able to see that training report around this phase in September. And we can see it is showcasing the training loss metric. Now, this is something that they were focusing on since, since September 1st, and they were able to just do this training within 90 days, which is really great to see. Now, to basically ensure that they were able to integrate this into other projects, what they did is that they used the exact same architecture as well as the tokenizer of Llama 2. And this basically means that they were able to easily plug and play in numerous open source projects that are originally built on Llama frameworks so that they can have an extendable framework with this new tiny llama this is something that brings in a lot more versatility and with its compact size it basically allows anyone to use the model this is a model that actually had a release schedule now you might be confused because i made a video on this before which showcased what this model is about so many people were actually confused as they thought that they released the full model at that time but they had a checkpoint schedule which i should have talked about which releases different like models that are trained on different tokens at that exact checkpoint so in this case on this date like today they or not today but like two days ago they officially trained the full model on three trillion tokens but on other dates you can see that it was trained on different checkpoints where they got to a one trillion token or like two trillion token so this is where they fully officially released this model that's trained on three trillion tokens 
as it took 90 days to do this and this is something that you can actually access today on hugging face you can download the model and you can start playing around with the full capability of this new tiny 1.1 billion model now there's a couple of ways to access tiny llama and to play around with it you can definitely start chatting with it off of hugging face spaces this is one way you can get the utilization of this new tiny 1.1 billion parameter model that is trained on the latest checkpoint which is 3 trillion but you're able to download it locally the 3 billion token training method uh that is trained on 3 trillion tokens sorry and you can easily do so by first having lm studio installed if you do not have it i definitely recommend you watch this video which showcases the easiest way to run any sort of open source lm using lm studio which is a video that showcases how you can install it so i'll leave this link in the description below but what you want to do is copy the model card for a tiny llama 1.1 billion this is the chat version model which is going to be trained on three trillion tokens so once you have lm studio opened up you simply want to go into the home page and paste this uh, model card into the search bar over here and click go once you click go if you do not see any model just click on compatibility guess and you'll see all these other models you want to find the tiny llama 1.1 chat uh chat version 1.0 gguf model which was something that was released on december 31st and once you have that uh found it like once you found it sorry <laughs> you want to click on that and you want to install the model you're going to be able to click on install and you'll be having it loaded up on the chat tab over here which you can just select the model to load and you can start chatting with it easily off of lm studio this is an easy way for you to chat with tiny llama locally on your desktop now just take a look at the evaluation metrics over here which tests tiny llama in various benchmarks and we can see that it tests these benchmarks are basically just testing the valuation of tiny llama on different categories like science math logic you have understanding reasoning question answering and so much more but we can see that obviously with a 1.1 billion parameter model you're not going to get something that's going to outpace chat gpt or like llama for example but in this case you can see that it has average scores that can compete against most open source projects with the 1.1 billion parameter model size it's able to do quite well in most categories where it has an average of 60 in common sense which is really great to see for such a model at its size now i want to answer a couple of frequently asked questions because there are really great questions to actually ask in this case they asked why would pre-training a 1.1 billion model for so long makes sense now they've answered this by basically stating that training a 1.1 billion parameter model for an extended period of time may be counterintuitive especially considering the chinchilla scaling law now this is a decision that they based on the obs observations from the llama 2 model where they basically were pre-training a 2 trillion token based model but it did not show signs of saturation in the training loss now this lack of saturation is something that suggests that the model is able to learn with an ongoing process and it did not actually plateau plateau meaning that it didn't just like stop and go in a straight pattern now what they've done is that they've incorporated this tiny llama project that aims to pre-chain the smaller parameter size but on three trillion tokens now it basically states that even if they were to incur a loss curve which doesn't decrease further the project is something that's able to value in studying the saturation phenomenon it's anticipating the insights that are gained from the process and it's something that makes this project more valuable and it contributes to a better understanding of how model training dynamics basically function and this is why they wanted to create this research so they can basically showcase this dynamic training method and that's basically it for today's video on Tiny Llama. This was something that is quite great to see as they were able to pre-train a 1.1 billion parameter model for an extended period of time based off of 3 trillion tokens. And it's just great to see that a model like this is capable of having a great average on various benchmarks. And it's something that I definitely recommend you check out. Anyone can access this basically on mostly every device possible. So 
i'll leave all these links in the description below i hope you enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for watching i really really appreciate it huge props to these guys as well for creating something like this and if you guys would like to follow us on our private discord where you can access amazing features definitely take a look at the patreon link in the description below make sure you follow us on twitter if you guys haven't already to stay up to date with the latest ai news and lastly make sure you guys subscribe turn notification bell like this video and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with the latest ai news but with that thought guys thank you guys so much for watching have an amazing day and i'll see you guys fairly shortly peace out fellas